What's going on, y'all? Mad Dad is back in this Mad Den. And I'm here to talk about Mad Den. And yes, we are here to talk about all the new team standouts. And give a little peep about 50 today. So thank y'all for watching me, and I hope you're having a great day. As always, if it's your first time watching me, thank you. Secondly, I'm on that road to 1,000 subscribers. It's a long road, it's a lonely road. You can help me on that long and lonely road. All you gotta do is hit that subscribe button, turn the notification bell on, and yes, you'll receive all this madness from Mad Dad as he gives it to you on Madden 21 and beyond. So thank you all for watching me, and again, I hope you're having a great day and a great start to your weekend. S-O-S-O. -so. That brings us to our team standouts that's coming in the game today. We talked about it yesterday in um, yesterday's video. A new set coming in the game. It will be inside Team Affinity. It will be the team standouts. And without further ado, let's just jump right into these new team standouts as we can kind of see what we got going on here. Um, as you see here, first and foremost, we got Kyler Murray. Um, 89 speed, 90 throwing power. Short accuracy, media accuracy, deep accuracy aren't that good, not that accurate. It's on the run is good. I think that's his biggest Achilles is the accuracy because we're having inaccurate throws right now. Uh, remember, all these cards do get power up so they don't have one already. So he'll be powered up a little bit. You might be able to cam him up and get some of those accuracies better, but probably not one of the better ones in the game. But I'm glad he got an upgrade though. It's gotta, we gotta work on these accuracies, man. Next up, we got Jason Pierre Paul. Um, left outside linebacker for the Bucks. He gets a power up now. You're gonna be able to put him on the Giants if you're an old Giants fan. 78 speed, 84 excel. That, that finesse move looking good. That play rec looking good. That's a decent looking card. Doesn't have a very many stats close to 89, but again, JPP coming home to some of y'all. Coming up next, we have Calvin Ridley, the wide receiver for the Atlanta Falcons. 91 speed, 82 jumping, 85 catching, 82 catching traffic. Um, the, the route running, the deep route running looks good. Short, medium, not the best. His speed is good. This is a pretty decent card, especially if you're Falcon fans out there that have Julio already. You're gonna have yourself a nice pair of, uh, you know, got Roddy White as well too. You're gonna have yourself some nice wide receivers. Who knows? Keep it going. Next up, Justin Simmons, free safety for the Broncos. 87 speed, 90 excel, 77 hit power. Decent zoned man. Broncos got himself a good one. Alden Smith, ex 49er, now Cowboy, doing a great year. Left end, 78 speed, not the best. 90 uh, power and 88 finesse look pretty good. Um, I'd probably say he's a decent card. Not the best ends in the game, we do have better ones. Uh, Legereus Sneed, this is a decent cornerback. 92 speed, 89 excel, 86 man, 86 zone, 87 press, 92 jumping. You probably came him up really nice with some, with, with some lockdowns and some sprinter. This is a decent card right there. I'd say he's probably one of the top three, in my opinion, which I'll go over at the very end. Next up is Shaq Thompson, middle linebacker. We have a ton of them in the game. 85 speed, 85 excel, 72 straight, 92 tackling. Not the best zone. Doesn't matter, linebacker. Kenny Vaccaro, hook him. Uh, 86 speed, 91 excel, 86 tackling, 88 play rec, 89. Um, I'm going to say 88 play rec. 77 man coverage, 83 zone coverage, 91 hit power. Good strong safety there. He's a little bit taller. I might like Kenny Vaccaro. Fred Warner, just another middle linebacker, man. Got better zone coverage though, 85 zone. Speed though is gonna kill him. Josh Allen, what everyone's been waiting for. Again, the accuracies, man. Give us these accuracies. Great throwing power though. If we can get, if we can get chemmed up with some bills, chem and some lockdown, I mean some lockdown, some go deep. You might be able to get some accuracies up. Or maybe even West, yeah, I think you need go deep. Get that throwing power to like 98. <laughs> Next up, you have Alvin Kamara. Shout out to Nelly. You know you want him. 88 speed, 91 excel. The 90 agility, 86 change of direction is not bad. Alvin Kamara getting some respect. DK Medcalf. Probably, I think, the best card coming out. 92 speed, 92 jumping. I'm sure his excel is good. His route running is decent. Deep and short. Medium is not to be desired. Spectacular catch. You get him on that uh, go deep, he's going to have 90s in a lot of those categories. My, probably the best one in my opinion. Jerome Baker, a uh, very fast middle linebacker. 88 speed, 88 excel. He's not no Sam Mills though. You know, we have tons of middle linebackers in the game, is my only gripe. John Bostic, 
we got one. Obviously, we got London Fletcher already, and we got Sam Mills. Of course, Washington needed another linebacker. He's having a great year. I'm glad we got him. 86 speed. He'll probably have about 90 on my team. Nothing spectacular. Derek Carr. Uh, a little bit more accurate with the short accuracy. He got good throwing power, but again, that medium and deep. We're going to have to chem him up. Chuck Clark. He's going to be a beast. 89 speed, 92 excel. Great coverage. Uh, Raven fans are going to be all over this one. He's close to the top three, but he didn't make it. Julian Edelman. Um, not very, not very. I mean, I think he has, he has one stat. Yeah, one stat above 89. Not very, you know, mind blowing there as far as he goes. Austin Eckler, 88 speed, 90 excel, 89 agility, 86 change of direction. Probably a great change of pace back, Christian McCaffrey style. Of him, Kamara, 90 speed, 90 excel. Kyle Fuller, who laid the pipe last night, laid the wood. <laughs> That's what I call it in the game last night to get that big game changing fumble. 90 speed, 90 Excel. 89 zone, the man though. Why did they give him that man? He showed he can play a man last night. Brandon Graham, Super Bowl hero, extraordinaire. Um, not very fast. Good power move, that's about it. Nothing spectacular. Duran Harmon, free safety. Good speed in Excel, great zone. 85 man. That's a decent one again. I'd probably put him in. Uh, Chuck Clark in the top five. Mike Hilton, 88 speed, 90 excel. Um, decent man in zone, nothing, nothing too good. Kareem Hunt, good speed, good excel, good carrying, good agility, good change of direction. I think him, Kamara, you know, Eckler all can be interchangeable. Good backs. Miles Jack, 4-3 linebacker. Uh, what is this? They even put a zone on here. 86 speed, though, is pretty good for him. Zero pass rush on this guy. He's definitely coverage. William Jackson the third. I definitely put him as well. Jesus. 91 speed, 90 excel. Great coverage. Great card right here, guys. Budget beast. I don't know how much you guys are gonna cost, but he's probably a budget beast. John Johnson the third. Decent card. Decent strong safety. We got a lot of good ones in the game right now. 91 excel. Eric Kendricks. Again, the middle linebacker. We got a ton of them, guys. Nothing too spectacular about him. Alan Lazard, huge, 89 speed, 90 jumping, good wide receiver. Probably won't get that many more upgrades because he got hurt, but still, he's a he's, he's decent card. I think Medcat's better. Darius Leonard, again, not really a pass rusher, coverage, left outside linebacker. Blake Martinez, middle linebacker. How many linebackers are they going to give us? Marcus May, this guy goes in my top three as well. 90 speed, 90 excel, good hit power. Definitely a budget beast, free safety. Um, and I think that takes us right back. Oh, another middle linebacker, McKinney. And there we are, right back to the beginning. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, loud, loud. oh, Terry, That's, those were not fire. I don't know why I put that on there. <laughs> but anyway, I think DK Metcalf, I definitely will pick up. I think that Marcus May. The William Jackson, those are good. And then the, the Sneed for the Chiefs are great corners. Quarterbacks aren't that good. Running backs are uh, compared to what we have right now, guys. So it's up to you if you want to go chase these out. Obviously, we get a free one from the solos today. There will be 32 solos dropping. And we also get, um, and it takes, again, 186 or above uh, team of the week player, four of the 82 and above, and then nine of the small 78s or above. So there you have it, guys. The team standouts are coming today. We also got teased one more thing as it was, um, who was it? Yes, we are getting DRC today. Dominic Rogers Camardi, as you guys can see right here. He's coming in the game with the 50, drops about two o'clock, two more. My guesses are Julius Peppers and a quarterback, probably Steve Young or RG3. Have a great day, guys. Mad Dad is out. Peace.